Hello there, Mr. Dragon. Hm, you're pretty cute for a quadruped. I wish I could take you on a tour of our temple, but a bunch of lousy earth shapers have encased it in stone. Thank you for releasing me. There are still some sages trapped in stone. It's great to be free! Now there is only one satyr left to rescue! <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
a dragon. Perhaps you can help. My friend is locked in this room and lost the key. And you know how hard it is to find a locksmith at this time of night. Now that you have rescued all the satyrs in Fracture Hills, you ought to go into the temple. <laughs> Hi, Dragon Boy. You're probably expecting me to be all like, You're my hero. Thanks for saving poor, helpless little me. Blah, blah, blah. Sorry, short stuff. I was only in here because I like the peace and quiet. Anyway, um, the other fawns wanted me to give you this talisman. <laughs> Um, sorry if I sounded unfriendly. I didn't mean to. <laughs>
Just stand still, he says. I'll turn your boots to gold, he says. Oh, hi, Spyro. You're a sight for sore eyes. I'd appreciate it mightily if you could locate that alchemist. He owes me a favor. I've been experimenting with this potion. I'd like to test it out, but the earth shapers out there have made going out a bit difficult. Could you kindly offer me an escort? Great! Just keep those earth shapers away from me and I'll take this potion to Hunter. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
Man, do my feet feel better. Would you look after this for me? Come back and meet me here when you've learned how to head bash and we can kick some Earth Shaper butt together. broke that door down for me. I thought I'd be stuck in here forever. I found this fancy orb in here. Please take it. Spyro, I suppose you're here for the party. I'm afraid it's been cancelled because the stupid Earth Shaper set off the volcano.
Well, if it isn't my best customer, the elevator in the next room can take you to the volcano. You can have unlimited use of the elevator for a one-time fee of only a few gems. It's a pleasure doing business with you. Simply step on the elevator and it will take you to the bottom. When you want to come back up, just step on it again. Thanks for closing the lid on the volcano, Spyro. Things were getting a little too hot around here. By the way, here's a talisman I was saving for the party later. I think you deserve it more. You're just in time for the party. Well, you would be if those nasty lava monsters hadn't stolen our hats. It just won't be the same without party hats.
Spyro, you saved the party. Here, this got mixed in with the cheese balls, and I almost chipped a tooth on it. Check out this cool cave I found. <laughs> Let's play a little game. Every so often, a piece of this crystal popcorn pops out of the ground. The first one to grab ten of them wins. I'm ready when you are. Okay, you win. Here's an orb. I'll give you another orb if you can beat me again. Let's play to 15 this time. What do you say? I'm ready when you are. You're really good. I'm going to have to come up with some harder games. For now, take this orb. I guess you earned it.
Good job, Spyro. Looks like you're ready for a more serious challenge. How about a little paragliding? You're not afraid of heights, are you? Great! I'll tow you behind my snowmobile and you maneuver through the rings. Don't miss any or we'll have to start over. Way to go, Spyro! You're even better than I am! Mm. 